Hello, hello. Hi, everybody. How are we doing? Happy, happy. Hi. Hi, everybody. How are we doing today? Um, welcome. My name is Rebecca Packard. Welcome to my kitchen floor. And we are going to be holding intention today. Um, each day on at seven days a week, we hold intention for peace. We just sit, we hold space, and we focus on holding intention for peace. And we do this every single day at 2 p.m. Eastern time. And we encourage other people to share. Hi, Ina. Um, we encourage other people to share um, and hold intention at the exact same time. You don't necessarily need to be on live with us. However, we do love when our community gets together mm -hmm. and shares time and has time together and is live. But if you're not able to hop on the live, we can have you hold intention wherever you are because we're just shifting energy. Mm -hmm. We're changing our mindset. We're changing our vibration. So we welcome you and thank you for joining us and thank you for sharing time and space with us and it is almost two o'clock i'm a little bit behind i'm not gonna lie hey nick thanks for hopping on and if you're hopping on and i haven't given you a shout out i'm sorry you don't pop up on the screen so if you say hi or say something i can say hi to you but it doesn't always happen that I um, get to see people. I had somebody ask me, you never say hi to me. I'm like, sorry, I don't see you when you hop on. I'm like, say hi next time, so I know you're there. Hi, Miriam, thanks for hopping on. Um, and so this is very easy. We just sit and hold intention, and we're just gonna think about what brings us peace, peaceful thoughts, whatever it is that makes you peaceful, who knows what that is because we all have different things that um, make us feel peaceful so whatever that is and it's now two o'clock so we can just sit and hold space and we're gonna do this for two to four minutes and then we'll chat
awesome. Yay, I'm so excited. You guys, what a great session. Um, so, I don't know where you are. Uh, I know that here it's kind of drizzly and overcast, but you know what? I had my windows open all morning. I would turn the heat down and open the windows and got some fresh air in and really like mixed it up because I'm like, oh, it feels more like April out today, which I'm loving. However, don't forget to shut the windows and turn the heat back up because it's going to get cold tonight if you're able to do that. But I was like, yeah, let's get that air swapped over so it's nice and fresh because who knows what February is going to bring. But I'm super excited because if you're on right now, Facebook message me your thoughts. I am going to be launching a workshop. This is going to be a free workshop that I'm doing in February and it's going to be a self-love workshop and I'm going to share different tip, trip, oh my gosh, tongue tied, um, tips and tricks of caring for yourself because you can't fill from an empty cup and you can't grow if you have nothing to grow from. Like if there's, n there's no nutrition in the soil, you ain't going anywhere, right? So, um, I kind of have had this thought for a little while and I'm putting it all into action now. So that is going to be something that's going to be um, coming up. But if you have any ideas or things you'd love me to add to that, or if you'd like to be um, sent an email or an invite when I do that, let me know. I'm going to end up sharing the link, obviously, but I'm really excited. I've been um, creating it for a little bit now not too long, but um, I've been saying, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this, but I'm really gonna do it now. So I'm super excited and I can't wait to share it with everybody. And hey, Cindy, thanks for hopping on. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Um, so if you have any ideas for that, just shoot me a little message. Um, but other than that, thanks so much for sharing intention with us. Don't forget, you can join the Meditation for Peace Maharishi Effect Facebook page and we can connect there and share what brings us peace, what um, brings you peace during your day, what are the peaceful things that you've created rituals around that make your day better. I do my affirmations in the morning and I do it around my um, coffee when I have coffee and it's kind of like a, a ceremony of sorts I would say and it's very peaceful and it's very like ritualistic and it's like oh okay so like these are different things that have um, helped me or helped me create um, a peaceful surrounding since I have two tiny humans who are kind of like hmm one second they're super peaceful and one second they're not if you were on yesterday you know what I mean I know right you guys are like just go take care of him like he's not gonna win <laughs> but you know what I mean every mom's been there every mom's done it right so if you have anything that you would like to share with me, please feel free to reach out and connect with me. I'm on Facebook, I'm on Twitter, I'm on Instagram, and I'm under Rebecca Packard NH, and you can just find me underneath Rebecca Packard. I pop up all over the place. So I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I hope you are sharing happiness and love and peace with the people around you. And don't forget, um, we are getting ready for our big um, happy acts and with doing that, um, Nathan and I are actually part of a fundraiser for Big Brothers and Big Sisters. We're working out every single day. Um, and with that, we have a little link for Big Brothers and Big Sisters. So if you felt obliged to participate in that and be part of our team on working out, or you wanted to donate to it, we're trying to help raise enough money to send a little or to pair a little with a big. And so um, it's a really amazing uh, opportunity and it's a really great foundation and it's helping so many kids. And I'm kind of all over the place today, but it, it is what it is, right? <laughs> so, all right, anyway, have a wonderful afternoon. <laughs>